Czesław Milosz's New and Collected Poems, 1931-2001, is a comprehensive collection of the poet's work spanning over 70 years. The collection contains poems from each stage of Milosz's career, ranging from his earliest works written in Polish to his later works in English. Throughout the collection, Milosz explores a wide range of themes, including the nature of love, the passing of time, the meaning of existence, and the relationship between humans and the natural world. One of the key themes explored throughout Milosz's work is the search for meaning in life. In many of his poems, Milosz grapples with the question of what it means to exist in the world. In The Separate Notebooks, for example, he writes, What does it mean to exist? But to put together all one separate notebooks and make of them a life. In this poem, Milosh suggests that the meaning of life lies in the process of piecing together the various fragments of our existence into a coherent whole. Another recurring theme in Milosh's work is the relationship between humans and the natural world. In many of his poems, he expresses a deep reverence for the natural world and its power to inspire and sustain us. In The Sun, for example, he writes, The Sun is my father. In my youth I believed in him. He has not disappointed me. Here, Milos suggests that the natural world, symbolized by the sun, can provide us with a sense of stability and guidance throughout our lives. Throughout his career, Milosh also explored the complex emotions and experiences that make up the human condition. In On Angels, for example, he reflects on the experience of falling in love. Love means to learn to look at yourself. The way one looks at distant things. For you are only one thing among many. Here, Milos suggests that love can provide us with a new perspective on ourselves and the world around us, allowing us to see ourselves as part of a larger whole. Another key aspect of Milos's poetry is his use of language. Throughout his work, he demonstrates a mastery of language that allows him to convey complex emotions and ideas with clarity and precision. In My Faithful Mother Tongue, for example, he writes, My faithful mother tongue, I have been serving you. Every night, I used to set before you little bowls of colors, so you could have your birch, your cricket, your viper, as preserved in my memory. Here, Milos celebrates the power of language to evoke vivid images and emotions, and suggests that language can serve as a means of preserving our memories and experiences. In conclusion, Czesław Milos's New and Collected Poems, 1931-2001, is a rich and complex collection of poetry that explores a wide range of themes and ideas. Throughout the collection, Milos grapples with questions of meaning, the relationship between humans and the natural world, and the complexities of the human experience. Through his masterful use of language, he is able to convey a sense of wonder and awe at the world around us, while also acknowledging its darker and more difficult aspects. Ultimately, Milos' poetry reminds us of the beauty and complexity of the world, and challenges us to see ourselves and our place in it with greater clarity and understanding.